Hotel room housekeeping courses. Hotel rooms are one of the major products of hotel. Providing a hygienic and safe accommodation for guests is the attitude and mindset that every hotel staff member should have. The housekeeping department is the contributor behind the scene to the success of a hotel. Housekeepers are the anonymous heroes of a hotel. With their hard work and dedication, the hotel rooms are clean, neat, and also fully equipped, so that guests can feel the warmth and coziness of the room and increase their satisfaction about the hotel. Quality and efficiency are not only the basic principles of housekeeping task, but also the goal that housekeeping management has been pursuing for a long time. To meet the hotel cleanliness standard, it is required to keep the room to the optimum state of cleanliness within the shortest period of time. The housekeeping department of a hotel is not only the department that maintains the cleanliness of the guest rooms, but also an important unit that maintains the hotel image. The guest room cleaning tasks are extremely cumbersome. To ensure that the cleaning tasks are done properly, housekeepers need to have the patience and physical strength. In addition, it is required to have a set of comprehensive working procedures. We are going to demonstrate the housekeeping task in three units. Unit 1 Cleaning Housekeeping First, knock on the door for three times. Second, shout housekeeping loudly. Third, keep a 5 to 10 seconds interval each time you knock on the door and shout. Fourth, never enter into the room when the do not disturb sign is placed on the door. Press the doorbell for three times, not too fast. Make sure that there's no one inside. I can open the door now. Return the lost items of guests. First, identify the lost items. Second, report to the reception. Third, put the item into a plastic bag. Fourth, write down the room number on a piece of paper and place the paper into the same plastic bag. Fifth, bring it to the reception. When a guest has left his belongings such as laptop in the room, report to the reception at the lobby first. Put the item in a plastic bag to avoid causing any damage to the item. Note down on the piece of paper the room number and the date that the item has been found. Place the paper in the same plastic bag Bring the bag to the reception after you finish cleaning the room. Check if the guest has left any belongings in the room. First, check every single area in the room. Second, check the safe box. After you enter the room, make sure that every single area is checked, such as the drawer, the wardrobe. Check the safe box as well. Supplies, replenishment, and room cleaning. Replenish the supplies, notepapers, water, slippers, and laundry bag. Make sure that the supplies in the room are sufficient, such as notepapers, water, slippers, and laundry bags. 
Please make sure that the notepapers are not folded. The hotel logos on the plastic water bottles need to face outward. Pick up any rubbish left by the guests on the desk or floor. I'm going to collect the rubbish now. Cleaning the door and wall. First, wipe both the door and the wall clean. When you wipe the door, wipe with the pattern, either clockwise or counterclockwise, from top to down. Wipe the back of the door and the door frame. Wipe from top to down. Do not miss the door bolts. All the doors and wall must be very clean. It is very easy to accumulate the dust if they are not cleaned in a long run. Making the bed. First, the amount of overhang of all sides of the bed sheet must be the same. Second, the bed sheet must be neatly tucked into the mattress. Third, the openings of the pillowcases need to face each other. First of all, remove all the used pillowcases, bed sheets, and duvet covers. The bed sheet needs to be spread evenly. Center the bed sheet on the bed, making sure that there is the same amount of overhand on all sides. Then, the four corners of the bed sheet needs to be neat. Next, make sure that the bedspread is placed evenly and looks full. After spreading the bed sheet on the bed, tuck the overhand of each side of the bed sheet under the mattress. Start with the head of the bed, then both sides of the bed, and then the foot of the bed. Make sure that each side of the sheet fits the mattress snugly. Once the bed sheet is spread evenly, go to the foot of the bed, tuck the duvet and both corners of the duvet onto the mattress. Pull the duvet evenly. Check if the surface of the bed is even. Leave a 25 to 30 cm space at the head of the bed for the pillows. Placing the pillows. The openings of the two pillowcases should face inward to make it look nicer. Cleaning the floor. Wipe clean the objects in the guest rooms. First, the surface above the head of the bed. Second, the desk. Third, windowsill. Fourth, black metallic surfaces. Wipe the desk surfaces and all items. Firstly, sort the cleaning cloth by colors. The yellow cloth in this video is for wiping the desk surfaces and objects such as wardrobes, coat hangers, and safe boxes. Then, use a purple cleaning cloth, as shown in this video, to wipe clean the mugs.
check the mugs in bright light to see if they are clean and make sure that there are no coffee or tea stains. Use a black cloth to wipe the back of the TV and also the window sills. Use the brown cloth to clean the black metallic surfaces. Sorting the cleaning cloth by colors ensure the hygiene and safety of the guests. Once the room is entirely cleaned, use the 75% alcohol spray to disinfect the room and the bathroom. Disinfect all the surfaces you can reach to ensure the hygiene of the guest room. After disinfection, put on a card that says disinfected as a way to confirm that the disinfection job is completed. After disinfecting the room, disinfect any surface in the bathroom that could be touched by the guests.